<sighs> Politics, eh? Yeah, now for something completely different. Sasha lives in his own house in a nice neighborhood. He's got a small garden with vegetables and pieces of wood. Which he keeps for the winter, it's quite cold in this part, but that, of course, is no news. All is well, except Sasha's got neighborhood issues. Next door to him lives this man, this woolly god. From his big garden he watches and jealously wants more. Sasha suspects that his was him last spring that secretly stole his shoes. It's pretty fair to say Sasha's got neighborhood issues. This morning he awakes to discover the fence has been moved. Igor says that it's not him and it cannot be proved. But Sasha's vines and a third of his pickles are now in his neighbor's garden. So Sasha rolls up his sleeves and says, I beg your pardon. <coughs> I can see clearly it's you that's behind it Your tools are lying by the fence We both know you've dug it up And moved it into my land It's only fair you give it back and I'll go But Igor said no Yet Sasha did not want to rush ahead to a conflict He did it But Igor put in quite a shift To keep what he nicked Sasha did all that he could, although he's not very good With all this fighting Now the right side of his face is just one big bruise All is well except Sasha's got neighborhood issues Down from the street Sasha thought that he did have friends François Gunther and David that he thought would help defend his land But in truth they're not too bothered Igor is quite crazy And it's risky to accuse him So Sasha's left on his own With whatever ensues All is well except for these Neighborhood issues All is well except for these Neighborhood issues Actually not all is well But it really makes it much more complicated with these Thanks so very much for watching. It's here live, almost, because, you know, it's YouTube. From the Maidan Square, it's right here. Lady Liberty here, although she's not called like that. It is called Independence Square. And from here, and from Ukraine, um, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye, uh, and I see you soon.